Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to show you how to use Droid Campo on my TV. As usual, before the video start, don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. In these days, everyone has installed OBS Studio for their PC. So I am not going to show you how to install OBS Studio. Ok, open your browser and search Droid Campo OBS. After that, go to the first link. Now scroll down and download Windows version of Droid Campo OBS. Now you can see it's downloading. Now I am going to open it. Ok, I minimized my browser and going to install the software for my PC. After that, I am going to show you how to set up your Droid Campo OBS in your Android device. Ok, open your Play Store in your Android device and search Droid Campo OBS. After that, install this application. It takes some time to download in my mobile. After it finished download, I am going to close Play Store. Now I am going to open Settings. After that, scroll down until you see About Phone. Go to the About Phone and touch the build number 7 times to unlock developer mode. I have already unlocked my developer mode. So go to the developer mode and enable USB debugging. This will allow you to use Droid Campo OBS with your USB cable. Now I am going to open Droid Campo OBS and click OK and allow your camera and microphone. After that you can see a Wi-Fi IP address. You have to use this IP address to connect Droid Campo your OBS. In this video, I will show you how to connect Droid Campo your PC using USB cable and Wi-Fi. So you need a working USB cable to connect to your phone to PC. If you want to use your Droid Campo PC using Wi-Fi, you need to connect your PC and your mobile to same Wi-Fi network. So I have connected my mobile and PC to same Wi-Fi. Now open OBS Studio on your PC. After that, click on plus icon and you can see Droid Campo OBS in there. Click on that and rename it as webcam if you want. After that, click OK. Now you can change resolution of your webcam. I am going to select 1080p. After that, to change setting, you have to type your IP address to connect using Wi-Fi. If you want to use audio from your mobile device, tick on Enable Audio. After that, click on Activate. Now I will show you how to connect DroidCam using USB cable. Click on Deactivate first. After that, click on Refresh Device List. Now you can see your phone model in Device. Select that and click on Activate. Now you can see it's connected via USB cable. I recommended you to use your Droid Cam for PC using USB cable because you can get low latency if you connect via USB cable. After that you finished in OBS Studio, you have to close it. After that you minimize, open, reject it on your PC. Now press Ctrl plus F2, open, find in, reject it. Now type OBS virtual camera and click on find next. After that you can see a friendly name of OBS virtual camera. 
you have to rename it as HD Webcam C300. You have to find two friendly name of OBS Virtual Camera. Just keep find until you find the next one. I have found the second one and now I am going to rename it. After that close, reject it. Now right click on this PC and click on manage. After that click on device manager. In device manager, you have to find camera. Right click on your camera and click on disable. If you don't see your webcam in camera, you can see your webcam in image in device. If you are a laptop user, laptop have inbuilt webcam. If you have inbuilt webcam, you have to disable it before connecting Droid Campo Omi TV. After all you done, open OBS Studio. Now click on Start Virtual Camera and Minimize OBS Studio. Now open your browser and go to the browser setting. Now search Camera and go to the site settings. After that click on Camera and select HD Webcam C300. After that Close this tab and go to the OMIT website. After that you logged in, you have to allow your camera and microphone. After that you allowed, you can see my droid cam is working with OMI TV. Ok, now you can see which webcam connected with OMI TV. I hope you guys learned something from this video. Thanks for watching.